Hi, this is Ben, and this is how you remove unwanted Google Calendars from Calendar for Mac OS X and iOS devices. So you can see the problem I've got right here is I have a ridiculous amount of calendars here uh, from my Google account. You can see right over here on the side, the, the problem is I have a lot of mobile labs that are available for checkout. Um, but in your situation, this could be rooms or other people's calendars, and you just don't want to see them. I could go ahead and I could uncheck all of these. But the issue is that these events are still here. They're still on my calendar. They're still on my mobile devices. I still get notifications uh, from them from time to time. What I want to do is just remove this from my calendar and my iOS devices completely because I really don't care about looking at these calendars when I'm looking at just my calendar or I'm on my mobile device. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to go ahead and go to google.com slash calendar slash sync select. This is the website that's going to allow me to decide which calendars get delegated to my devices. So I'm going to go ahead and log into my account. And once I'm in my account, you can see right here, this is where I can select which calendars get pushed out to my iPhone, iPad, uh, and iCal, or now as it's known, Calendar for Mac OS X. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm just going to uncheck all of these mobile calendars. Okay, when I'm all done, I'm going to scroll to the bottom and I'm going to click save right here. And once that's saved, my sync settings are all set. I can open up my calendar client as it says here to see what it looks like. So let's go ahead and let's do that. I'm going to quit out of my calendar. And when I start my calendar back up, it's going to go ahead and it's going to take a little bit of time to update. And there we go. That's much better. Now I don't have to worry about turning those calendars off. And more importantly, I'm not going to get those little updates that pop up here in the corner. Because like I said, even though you don't have it checked, the events are still there and the notifications are still there as well. I hope that helps. That works for your iOS devices and calendar, or if you're running an older version of OS X, iCal.